I'm gonna try this again. This morning I tried to make a video and I wasn't aware that I had 15 minutes to do so, so I'm gonna try to keep an eye on the timer and um, I try to keep this one under 15 so I can upload it. The one in the morning I titled Memorial Day 2016 and that was the one where I was driving to work this morning and that one's over like 16 minutes long. It wasn't able to upload but I will as soon as I get a chance. I'll have to allow for extended video to be uploaded anyways. Um, just wanted to talk about pretty much how my day went today, this afternoon. Um, you know, I mean, it's no different. It started thinking of, of you girls. I pray one day you watch this. So it started off thinking of you. And that's how it's date pretty much all day. Every day. I mean, I always think about you. And one of the things I keep thinking about, one of the things that worries me is the fact that a year's approaching and we've not seen each other. As it, as it were, when I would see you a little bit more often, I mean, there'd be a, an awkwardness there, you know. It would take a little while to get acclimated, you know. But then when we did, you know, we would talk, we would laugh, things would feel great. That was only after a week or two or a month sometimes of not seeing y'all there'd be that weirdness and it took a while to gel again we're approaching a year now you've you've been in a whole new family environment, a whole new way of, you, you just experienced a whole lot, something I wish I didn't put you through, but now you're, now you have, you know, a step, whatever. I'm not there and, and all I just keep thinking about all day is uh, you know maybe you've gotten used to me not being there anymore you've gotten used to me not being in your life anymore maybe you think things are better without me You know, I fear that that you think that you know why would you want to do the meetings you know, that's a whole other issue but the visitations why would you want to do them, why would you you know, I just that you girls are that y'all feel like y'all are better off why would you want to you know visit with me the source of your pain and your torment you know I just feel like you've been away for so long and You don't have to be around me anymore and 
in my drunken ways. And I also don't even know how long it will be till I ever see you again. I mean, I'd have to go to court, hire a lawyer, and fight or request the, the rights to see y'all. Right now they've been abated. It, paying the child support, which is, you know, something y'all deserve, that I'm just barely getting by, how am I going to pay for it? It's enough to fight to see you girls, you know? I just fear that y'all think that I don't want to see y'all. But that's not the case at all. You know, I'm incomplete without you girls. <laughs> and every day, I think of everything I've done and said, and I can't believe I put us where we are. I kick myself every day. I can't believe I'm divorced. I can't believe she's remarried and I can't believe y'all essentially just have a new family. And it's all, you know, my doing. I take my part. I will do my part. I will acknowledge the things that I've done. But you're... I'll just take my part. And I fear that some of you don't want to see me. I mean, it's, I just think back when, when I was calling you girls and, I mean, Connie and Travell, y'all had the phones at the time I had y'all's numbers and I would call and y'all wouldn't, you know, y'all wouldn't answer my calls. Me and your mom weren't divorced yet and you weren't answering my calls and, you know, and that hurt. You know, and that puts fear in me that maybe you girls really don't want me around. Your mom says y'all don't. According to your text, Connie, you, you know, you, you, you know, you su suggested that it was better off that I didn't attend the first day of school this year, which was the first one I've ever missed. I mean. You're old enough to do that. You're old enough to say that. Just didn't think you would, you know. Just 
pray that you know you girls can forgive me. I know it's gonna be easy to side with your mom, and I mean, I know that y'all saw you know my recent ways, and you know. So that's why I'm sure you're protective of your mom where you will be, or y'all, def- you know, y'all will come to her defense, which is all right. Don't forget about those days either, you know? Don't forget about those days, how much I tried to to make y'all laugh. How I tried to just show y'all things and give y'all things. But it's, it's just, just everyday life. Somebody can do a thousand good things, but they do one thing wrong, and that's that thing that's memorable, you know? I'm not saying I only did one thing wrong, but that is a fact of life, that people can do a thousand good things for you. But it's the bad things that people remember always. I just ask, can you remember the good things, please? Because I think I try to do a lot of good with the limited resources I had I mean try to give y'all things as much as possible um, you know any money we had went to y'all you probably feel like y'all grew up with nothing we had less because we gave it all to y'all I did and there was my joy But I know you're going to be focused on the bad. I just pray. You allow me to... Redeem myself, maybe? You allow me... That opportunity to show you I love you. I had that high up extremely remorseful. Yeah. Please give me another chance. 